So it's interesting uh, that currently uh, in this nation, there is yet another highly controversial topic in relation to the oil industry. All right, so MiamiCan.com and StopSpraying.org um, uh, points out the conflict between the so-called Zika virus, which has been around for decades, and the cultivation process is uh, patented by the uh, Rockefeller Foundation. Rather, they own the patent for the cultivation process of the Zika virus. Um, and so local communities, uh, especially, well, primarily in the U.S. here so far in, in, in Miami, uh, has sprayed its population with uh, Nalid. Uh, Nalid is known to cause microcephaly. However, um, Zika is not. There's no direct link. There's no science showing that Zika causes microcephaly. Okay, so uh, yesterday I broke down the a an agent in Dibrom, which is essentially Nalid, which contains something called Ethion, which contains a lead element called tetraethyl. And it was tetraethyl gasoline that was sold to Nazi Germany from standard oil to fuel the Nazi war regime, uh, the air regime. So my biggest issue is now currently in South Dakota, a pipeline is supposedly being built across a, an Indian reservation, which violates what I've been told, pacts between the U.S. government and the uh, the Sioux people of the Dakota. Um, folks, plain and simple. Look, everyone wants prosperity. Everyone wants a strong economy. Everyone wants a strong uh, uh, um, uh, economy, society. Uh, we all want to prosper in life. But, but when others are prospering at um, the expense of someone else, that's when there is an issue. Now, I say that, but there's always going to be a yin and yang. Um, the problem is pros prospering via the oil industry is killing the planet and it's killing us. And from what I'm understanding in regards to aerial springs, it's literally uh, killing the brain of, uh, of children in the developmental stages during pregnancy of women. So building a pipeline in the Dakota to further this dependency on oil and big oil is disgusting and has to stop. As a civilization globally, we have to get off of the oil uh, standard, if you will. All right, that's all for today. MiamiCan.com, StopSpraying.org. And I just tied it into this ridiculous fiasco going on in Dakota, which is violating these uh, the rights of the, these Sioux, Sioux Indians, from my understanding.